CAN, or Community AIDS Network, celebrates its 25th year in Sarasota with a musical world premiere that addresses the complexities of HIV and AIDS. ABC 7's Alex Redman joins us with more on CAN's growing presence in Florida and the Kanada for CAN. Alex. Thank you, Haley. CAN started in a tiny building on East Street in Sarasota. Now 25 clinics strong, they're helping thousands with HIV and AIDS right here in Florida. I am one of the ladies who lunch. I live on a key. Well, when I sang the lyrics about an actual woman from one of our keys right here on, on the Florida coastline and the difficulty she had once she knew she had AIDS, that she would come into Cannes wearing her Jackie O sunglasses in fear of being seen. The world premiere of Cantata for Can addresses stigma, hardship, and tragedy of HIV and AIDS. She would park far away, and she would come into the building, and she would be treated for whatever she needed to be treated for. It just touched my soul. International opera singer Carol Sparrow and husband tenor Randolph Luck perform at the Community AIDS Network's 25th anniversary celebration. This piece of music was written by a world-famous opera composer who's just moved to Sarasota. His name is Thomas Passacheri. Scott George, Cannes Director of Community Development, wrote Cantata for Cannes lyrics. There's a heartbreaking story about an Iraqi war veteran with AIDS, and all he has left is his dog, Sam. These vignettes or songs are actually real stories of our clients. Cannes president and CEO Richard Carlisle explains the need for Cannes growth. We started with one clinic uh, and we are 25 clinics now in locations all over Florida and we have 10,000 patients in our network. People are living longer with the virus, says Carlisle, but bringing numbers of newly diagnosed HIV cases down is paramount. But what really is happening is the spread of HIV is an epidemic and in particular amongst our youth and over 55 population. Words of the cantata start with, 30 years, no cure for AIDS. Carlisle also has a strong message. And we will do more. Uh, we will be in more locations and take care of more patients in the future. Not since the breakout Broadway musical Rent has the topic of HIV and AIDS been addressed with a full body of musical work. And Ken hopes this raises more awareness of the growing number of HIV cases here on the Sun Coast and throughout the state of Florida. Back to you, Haley.